Devotees of the 1970s sitcom MASH will remember Major Charles Emerson Winchester III, the haughty surgeon who declared, I do one thing, I do it very well, and then I move on. It turns out he was holding one of the keys to happiness. The human attention span is finite. Multitasking might feel efficient, but it's actually detrimental to the job at hand and to the person doing it. Your brain is designed to focus, and it can't focus on two, three, or more things at a time. Sure, you can do them all, but you'll be sacrificing the problem-solving skills and the expertise you would bring to each task if you did them one at a time. Think you're better when you're multitasking? Actually, so do most people. But according to publications like Psychology Today, Health, and Forbes magazine reporting on scientific research, multitasking causes anxiety and errors, and it takes more time than if you perform the tasks one at a time. According to Gary Winch, PhD, who's done extensive studies on switch tasking, moving back and forth between tasks reduces productivity. Plus, you never get that in the zone feeling. By the way, scientists call multitasking switch tasking because that's exactly what your brain is doing. Switching back and forth from one task to the other. It's sort of like your brain's playing a tennis match with itself. So resolve to do one thing, do it very well, and then move on to the next thing. Your stress levels will take a tumble while your happiness quotient skyrockets. I'd love to hear how solo tasking leads to happiness for you. Please contact me here or on my Facebook page and share your wisdom. And if you'd like a happiness quick tip to show up in your inbox to start off each week right, sign up and it's yours. Just scroll to the bottom of any page on my website, sandyjweaver.com, because the sign-up form is right there in the footer. Have a happier day. Remember, you're in charge.